Bonjour étudiants. Good evening my dear students. Comment ça va? How are you? So aujourd'hui, je étudie vous le inversion. Today I'm going to teach you the most important topic is inversion. Inversion it is the part of trouver la question third part, right? So there are three conditions you have to take care that number one in inversion we will start it with the verb dash then pronoun then object right then question mark par example va tu o marche Are you going to mark it? Right? Mm. So here the verb is not ending with vowel and mm. the pronoun it is also not starting with the vowel. Is it clear? Yes. Now second condition is when there is verb ending with vowel And in between verb and pronoun, it will be T. Right? And pronoun starting with vowel and object. Then question mark. Please always put question mark at the end of the question because student doesn't do that hai na iski kya zarurat hai but when you are asking a question it it should be question mark not the full stop right yes. you, when you are giving the answer it should be full stop hmm. so the verb ending with uh, va it is ending with vowel then il or l right hmm. they are ending with Vowel. They are starting with vowel. Starting with so in between I will put here T. अब मैम कैसे पता लगेगा? मुझे यही सही पता लग जाएगा क्योंकि मेरा जो दिमाग में impression रहेगा वो हमेशा analyze करेगा कि ending word vowel तो नहीं है, starting word vowel तो नहीं है. ठीक है? तब मैं करूँगी. And then U C N E M A. ठीक है? Hmm. Is she going to cinema? Yeah, is he going to cinema? Third, when the name is given, when the name is given, for example, Richard Joy. O foot. We will write football, but we will pronounce till foot. Okay. Now it is in this. Uh, sorry, in this sentence, name is given. So what I will do? I will put my name Bahar name, and then there must be a comma, like Richa. Richa, comma, then my verb. Acha, what is the trick that you will find the verb? Or verb always come after the subject, subject. immediate subject. Okay, this is what verb J O U E. यहीं पे मैंने analyze कर लिया. It is ending with E, so it will fall under second category. With the vowel in place of richa, what pronoun it is used? Uh, L. L for the singular feminine. Mm -hmm. L. L. Then it is automatically T will come in between them. Oh. Okay. okay. And then O. Foot. Mm -hmm. So here. Mostly the verb will end with 
vowel mm-hmm. mostly because mm-hmm. here we uh, need to replace either with the boy il el ills mm-hmm. or else mm-hmm. so every time il else mein verb will not end with e otherwise il el mein to verb ending with e ho gayi mm-hmm. that we know that yes hmm then pronoun pronoun bhi kaisa jo name ko replace karega theek hai and then object hope this three steps have cleared your query about the inversion yes right so thank you for asking uh, about your problems how to solve it and give me more topics in which i can make more and more informational videos educational thank you thank you for giving me so much love bye bye oriva abhyanto see you soon